Yo, what is going on everyone and welcome back to the channel, hope you guys are doing well. In today's video we're going to be talking about everything we know so far about the new upcoming Fracture live event of Fortnite Chapter 3 because I'm sure you guys know that the Fracture live event is going to be uh, the last event of uh, Chapter 3. Because you guys may remember, over two weeks ago, whenever the FNCS Invitational Cup was about to end, they just showed us this promotion which it says, Fracture December 3, 4 p.m. Eastern Time, Chapter 3, Final Event. So after this promotion, the entire community knew that Chapter 4 Season 1 is officially going to be our next season, coming out on December 4. In this video, I am basically going to be giving you guys all of the details that we know so far about the live event. Like, for how long is it going to be? Um, we got us with some pieces lately, official artwork as well over the past few days, which is insane. Uh, for those of you guys who don't know, over a few days ago I made another video of me talking about everything we know so far about the new chapter. But this one is going for live events, so if you guys want to check out the other video, feel free, check that out, the link of that is in the description below. Now if you guys want to support your boy, use go fire gamer in that shop and drop a like, we would really appreciate it, and share this video as well. Alright, so over like a few days ago, the first, uh, I'm gonna say, uh, Chapter 4 live event artwork was revealed. Hypex said Chapter 4 event artwork technically is a fracture event. Uh, if you guys will also be taking a closer look, we can see pretty much a couple of chrome tornadoes. So maybe whenever the live event will start, we might be seeing some chrome tornadoes trying to destroy the entire map which by taking a look on that artwork we can see that they are trying to destroy the entire map also earlier today the december crew pack bundle got revealed there's a loading screen a scan and obviously pickaxe backlink and v bucks too so i fixed that again crew pack loading screen upcoming skin teaser you may see another member of the high stakes club soon like very soon if you guys will be taking a closer look at the back of the skin at the setting the sword, we can see two skins on the left side and as well as on the right side. So those two skins are pretty much survey skins for those of you guys who don't know as they were leaked pretty much before like Radical maybe. So what I'm trying to say is that those two skins on the back might either be um, the chapter 4 season 1 battle pass skins or there will be obviously item shop skins or some sort of like that but those two skins are 100% they will be coming out in chapter 4 because we can see them they are pretty much new skins and they were also spotted in the survey skins before for those of you guys who don't know yet that earlier today we just got as well our first official teaser of the new upcoming fracture live event you guys see here there is the man cake skin which is floating in the space so I believe that this might be a sign that we might potentially be flying in the space during the event. I'm super excited for it. So over the past few days, we just got as well three more teasers. So this is the second teaser, this is the third teaser, and this is as well the fourth teaser. As you guys can see, pretty much going to be as well the last teaser. So obviously we are going to be like flying through the space, maybe during or maybe at the end of the event. So. Yeah, it's gonna happen tomorrow, I'm super excited. Hypex said as well a few days ago, everyone who logs into Fortnite from December 2 to December 4 will receive the Toasty Roast emote, which I'm sure is gonna be free of course. They said as well, Fortnite mentioned that the event starts at 4 p.m. Eastern Time and you can also join in progress until 4.40 p.m. Eastern Time, a whole 40 minutes. That is not confirmed, there are just basically theories, but hopefully it will be that long because I just heard people like people saying that this is gonna be the biggest live event in the history of Fortnite, over like around 800 or 900 megabytes, which is super insane. They also said chapter 4 event teaser reality 153. Now to be honest guys, I don't really know what does reality 153 mean, but according to the Lakers, this is basically a teaser. They also said another Fortnite Chapter 4 event promo art spotted by Tigers are my favorite. You guys can see this how it looks like. Again, it is pretty much teased. We can see some chromes and like some, uh, I'm gonna say, cracked rocks. I don't know, y'all, but yeah, this is basically a promotion. We have as well some more information to talk about, so I wanna give credit to Echo Fortnite News. It says below, looks like after the event, we'll be wandering around in space after reality zero's destruction, which this kind of like makes sense. So I don't think that we're gonna be flying to the space uh, pretty much 
during the event, which this is so awesome. They said as well in Event Theory, first, the zero point starts flickering through realities to avoid using the chrome and in the process we see portals to different realities, 153 and 602. Second of all, after reality's zero destruction, we see the realities from where the zero point with our help will reforge reality. As you can see as well, there is the image uh, which we can see the zero point, the drifts can join something, and yeah. Echo said as well, under new reality, reality 602. So far we have reality 659, 153, and as well as 602. I suspect that a mustard will give us a few more true of his location. These are likely part of the fracture event. We have as well some more information to talk about, so credit to Echo. They said Donald Mustard has been teasing the current point of the story from all the way last year with Midas the Nothing. And now I think we can safely say that this is what he meant with well until that one thing. So basically Donald Mustard was already teasing about that like from like a year ago, whenever I believe the clip came out that Midas was dead. They said as well all Fortnite realities we know of, Reality Zero, The Last Reality, Reality 659, Paranorms Reality, Reality 153. Realities 8992 and 35 are most likely random realities among others, where general particles were scattered. They said as well guys, Reality 153, this is Donald Mustard's new location, previous one being Reality Zero. Maybe the zero point will actually move everything to a new empty reality to re-establish the loop, which I think this kind of like makes sense. So these are all of the informations that we know so far. Now besides all these informations like the reality stuff, you know, the zero point, I'm sure that you guys know that there's our opponent as well, the Herald, that she was trying to spread the crumb right on the map. So I'm pretty sure that we're obviously going to be trying to protect the map by fighting against the, you know, the Herald, the Chrome Queen. Or maybe she might be trying to attack on a zero point and we might not be letting her do that. You guys know what I mean? We never know what's gonna happen. I'm super excited. Again, just to remind you guys that this event, it is gonna be taking place at next Saturday, I believe, pretty much as of on, um, you know, December 3, 4 p.m. Eastern time. So after the live event ends, we're obviously gonna be getting stuck on uh, like I'm gonna say uh, maintenance now there were leakers saying that we might be getting stuck on a black hole or if it is not black hole similar to the black hole something like that pretty much between like 10 to 12 hours that obviously the new chapter 4 will begin new collaborations new battle pass new map and much more I'm super excited and yeah you guys don't want to miss out these upcoming future videos here on the channel because you guys know me man i always try to keep you guys up with everything with fortnite stuff the collaborations the cosmetics and more make sure you guys drop a like share if you guys found the video helpful and give your thoughts about this down below in the comments or if you guys have any questions let me know in the comments i'll see you guys for the next video and have a good one